Hey Broncos, here at KJ Fagan, coming off our Gonzaga Portland trip. KJ, what did you think about the Gonzaga game and what did you learn from the way we fought back in the second half? I just learned that when we just get into a flow and attack the basket that we are a very lethal team and that we could get things going. And um, I, we, we did a good job of taking care of the ball. I think we had about four turnovers that game. So, I mean, that's pretty good. We just have to come out and then start the game like we did in the second half and it would have been a totally different game. Definitely. I would say the way we played in the second half really fueled us for the way we played at Portland. What are your thoughts on that game? Uh, Portland, we just said we were just going to go out and attack the rim, you know, just keep it going, just keep attacking. Um, they're a transition team, but they don't do well in transition, um, guarding the ball. So we just said we were going to push it. And um, we got going in that uh, at the end of the first half where we went up by like 14 or 15 or so. And we seen what we do, we can do when we push the ball. So that was our game plan. It was another close game with Portland. Uh, I think they came back in the second half and, and really got it close there. But I think uh, the teammates, uh, all of us, we stood together and we knew we had confidence that we would be able to win the game. They made a little run and the game got closer. But I think we held our composure and we knew we had confidence in each other and we were able to close out the win. So I think that would be big for us heading into USF, which is another rival, as you know. Uh, it was a close game here at our place. Uh, what do you think is the plan as we go there? Uh, just like in the second half, we, we really stuck together. They started playing four guards. And um, Brendan and uh, Hauser and Kai were able to step up and just be those, you know, glue guys for us. And Nate and Hubbard were able to guard their guards when we were switching ball screens, stuff like that. So um, our, our bench was a very key part, and it helped us keep our composure and gain our confidence. And going into USF, um, we just have to play the same game we did there, just keep attacking, stay on the attack, and um, really commit ourselves on the defensive end to play like we did in the first half of Portland. And it'll keep them to one shot. They're a big offensive rebound team. So keeping them to one shot and pushing the ball. Most definitely. It'll be an action field weekend with the, the game on Saturday against rival USF and then Super Bowl 50 uh, coming up on Sunday. So it should be a good one. Tune in. Thanks for listening. Coach Jay talked a lot about how we need to offensive rebound and really exploit um, their rebounding, and you really took that to heart. You had 13 rebounds. How, what do you think you went into the game thinking? How did you, that motivate you? Men's basketball fell at Gonzaga on Thursday and rebounded to beat Portland 90-84 to on Saturday. Jared Brownridge led all scorers with 38 points in the Broncos' victory over the Pilots.